Like 100 frames a second, please. Okay. Hasn't changed that to a. Oh, no, no, no. I need to change the resolution. Is that done? Oh, tip. If someone asks you to change to 100 frames and you're currently set to 5K, 50th of a second shutter, there's more than one setting that you'd need to change. If you incorporated this all as a preset, you could do it in a single button press. And here's how to do it. So first, have your camera set up exactly how you wanted it for your, say, 25 frames a second, for example. I'll go into presets, I'll hit create, I'll call this 25 frames per second. Once I've named it, I'll go into the project menu where all of the controls for this preset are. Then I'll move over just the settings that I want to target. So firstly will be exposure time target. The next thing will be red code. After that will be record format. And sensor frame. I'll create that as a preset. Next, I'll set the camera up exactly how I need it for 100 frames a second. I'll then go back into presets. I'll hit create again. I'll call this one 100 FPS. And then I'll move over exactly the same settings. I'll hit create. Now that these two presets are created, I'll go about assigning them both to a key. Rather than a hard key, I prefer to assign these to a soft key on the touch LCD, but where you assign them will just be on preference. So go into settings, then set up, then keys. Go to the soft keys tab. Drop down one of the drop boxes and search for apply preset and find your preset. You only need to search for APP as that will bring up anything containing APP. I like to press show key actions as labels so that I know which preset I'm applying. When you touch the side of the screen, your two presets are there. Just to test that, I'll jump to my 25 frames and all of my settings will change at once. I hope that tip saves you time. Oh man, come on, I need you to be professional. Don't look me in the eyes, man.